When Humphrey Bogart's career began in 1921, he had no formal acting training whatsoever. And it showed the reviews of his first production, they were at least polite, but they were less than favorable. What really set Bogart apart from the rest of his ilk was that he despised pretentious fakes and phonies. In fact, he spoke out against them all the time. Disgusted by the inferior movies that he himself was a part of, he developed the complex of a soured idealist who was cursed to live out his days in New York instead of Hollywood amongst inferiors having to live off his wit and his drink. He constantly cursed out second-rate actors and to the delight of the Hollywood press always spoke out against bad productions and bad producers. The visions of his soured idealism came true in 1999 when the American Film Institute elected him as the greatest male lead of all time. So this is only one reason why Humphrey Bogart has so much mojo. But look at the list, it's impressive. First of all, he had integrity. He spoke his mind, but it went beyond that his integrity. He lived out his own complex and he lived out his own rebellion. And of course, he partied harder than anyone else of his time. And that's probably half of what made him the greatest male lead.